I want to shoot a video demonstrating a new feature within Music Player Remix. One of the most requested features I've received over the past few weeks is for in-app album art downloading. So I've gone ahead and implemented it. Um, but I've done it in a way that's a little bit different than you may expect. But let me go ahead and go to the now playing screen. And you'll notice that this song doesn't have any album art. Um, so it's displaying the, the default uh, album art image art album art image um, for the silk song girl you girl you for me um, so you would expect that on the now playing screen I'd have some kind of option here to be able to download album art um, or maybe a new icon to do that but I haven't done that um, and the reason why is that album art is really associated with a whole album not just one particular song so for this album which is called lose control I want every single song from lose control to have the new album art once I've downloaded it. So instead of implementing it on this screen, I've implemented it on the album screen, um, which lists the songs within the album. But what's nice about this is that on Music Player Remix, I can just tap the song information right here, and it's going to bring me right to that screen. So I have one touch easy access to my album art um, downloading, even though it's not actually available on the now playing screen. But anyways, this screen has been redesigned. If you're familiar with the public beta, you'll notice it looks a lot different. Um, you have some information here that's being displayed. Uh, one is the artist name. Um, second is the release date of the album, which is kind of nice um, to know. Um, also the record label. And a link to this artist's website. So I can load that up um, and view that website if I'd like to. Um, it also has the song list, and you'll notice that each song uh, lists the actual time uh, duration of the song, which is showing up as 0000, zero, zero, zero right here for all the songs. But the actual final version, you know, if Freak Me is 4 minutes 32 seconds, then it's going to show 4 minutes 32 seconds. Um, so let's see, what else? Um, oh, album art. That's the whole point of this video. Okay, so let me tap the album art, and that's going to bring up a selection of options. Um, that it's pulled from the web and under each option you're going to have the resolution of this image so if I want a smaller um, picture a 300 by 300 I could choose this one but if I want a larger one which looks a little to be a little more clear and it's going to be look nicer on high resolution devices which hopefully we'll get for Palm later this year hint hint um, then I want to choose this one so let me choose this one 800 by 800 and it downloaded it um, pretty quickly over Wi-Fi um, and there it is. So now if I go to the now playing screen, it has the album art assigned to it. And for every song on this album, by the way, so if I choose Lose Control, that song, it's also going to have it for that one as well. Um, now if I want to restore the original album art, which in this case was nothing, um, I can do that as well, and it will restore that. Now, let's say we have an album. Let's see. Let's see if we can find an album that actually has album art. No, that one doesn't either. Okay. Let's see. Let's go ahead and just do Shuffle All. We'll find one. Ah, oh, this has album art. Okay, so let's go ahead and load this album. And let's see if we can find some other album art. So let's say I didn't particularly like this album cover, and I wanted to do something else. Let's see. Um, let's see. I just wanted to do this one. I could go ahead and overwrite the built-in art album art with, with something I download. So you have that option as well. So now if I go back to the now playing screen, um, that's uh, listed on there. And again, I could restore that to the original as well, and it's restored. So that's uh, in-app album art downloading, uh, available in Music Player Remix. It's not going to be in the public beta, so don't go looking for it on PreCentral. Um, the reason why is I'm using a new database storage system called DB8 for the album art, uh, which is only in WebOS 2.0. Um, and there's a couple particular reasons I'm doing that. You can go v uh, visit the Precentral forum thread. I'll talk about that a little in there. Um, but anyways, it's only available on WebOS 2.0, and hence it's only available on my private beta that's running on my developer device. So, But it'll be available... Um, in the app catalog version, which will hopefully be available soon um, once WebOS 2.0 is released by Palm um, sometime, hopefully soon. Okay, um, thanks for watching the video and look out for some more.